I was never good. I'm an international choker. I'm washed up past my prime. I get carried by my teammates. I'm toxic. I play with no brain. I just got lucky. I'm a quitter. So why did I come back? I'm one of the OG pro players. Back when I first started playing, there were no heroes. No villains either. Over the years, I've been both. People either love me or they hate me. They think they know me, but they don't. The most agonizing defeat of my career was for Samsung. Turrets are dead, the inhibitors as well. Doublelift gonna lose his life with impeccably bad timing. That's never happened to me before. I've never been the catalyst for a loss. That one awful decision that I made, yeah, I think about that like over and over and over again, just how stupid I was and how I cost my team so much. So I made the announcement like, hey guys, I'm gonna take a break. So I went on a little break. I'd been a pro for six years and when you play competitively at that level for that long, you basically haven't had a life. I never even had a serious relationship until Bonnie. When you're in a long distance relationship, you have to make the most of it. Suddenly I had time, time for Bonnie, time to stream, time to live a normal life. I should have been happy. But then I'd watch TSM play. I'd watch my team play without me and I'd be miserable. I didn't really love streaming as much as I loved playing pro, and I feel out of place when I'm not playing with a team that I have such a connection with. That's when I realized I love competing. I don't want a normal life. I spent four years not winning anything, and then I finally won something and I had a taste for being a champion. That's what I want, you know, but I want it bigger. I don't want to just win an LCS. I want to win Worlds and I hope people will remember me as one of the first North American world champions. So why did I come back? I came to win.